Recent school committee discussions have involved the poor conditions and inadequate capacity to house students at both Hillside and Mitchell Elementary Schools. This ongoing discussion has also become a concern for the Board of Selectmen, and at their latest meeting, they discussed the process involved to begin potential school renovations. Before renovations at either Hillside or Mitchell School can begin, several steps need to occur first. At the recent Board of Selectmen meeting, school committee members were invited to share with the selectmen their first draft of a statement of interest required by the Massachusetts School Building Authority. The selectmen were asked to review and edit the SOI and prepare a revised copy before the next school committee meeting on February 26th. The school committee will then vote on which school they wish to have renovated first at their following meeting on March 5th. Once a decision is made, the Board of Selectmen will have the final say during a vote on March 19th. We have until April 10th to submit uh, state these statements that are signed um, and certified by both boards. And that will then begin a conversation with the MSPA, a, more, a formal conversation. According to Superintendent Gutekantz, the school committee is leaning towards renovating Hillside School first due to its greater lack of size to house students. In addition, the school committee is also faced with deciding if the school will be rebuilt at its current location or relocated. Doran Whittier Architectural Firm was recently hired to conduct a pre-feasibility study at DeFazio Field, which is one of several potential options for a new school location. What we are doing is following the process of submitting the SOI first, waiting for a response back from the state, assuming we are moved into feasibility study. There may be a number of different options that emerge from that feasibility study, including perhaps options that we haven't considered or haven't been suggested in either of the pre-feasibility studies, and only after that process will there be a vote by the school committee to select one of the options to move forward with um, and put forward to the voters. It will be a long-term plan before renovations can begin. If the Massachusetts School Building Authority accepts the statement of interest, the projected timeline to get started is September 2018. For the Needham Channel News, I'm Joe Sarantino.